good morning. Welcome to the show. I'm Corinne. And I'm LaShondra, and together we're KNL Everyday CNA. I'm just going to tell you right off the bat, we're going to be using our cards a lot today. <laughs> so LaShondra and I want to show the diversity in the CNAs. Most people believe that the only type of job setting you can find a CNA is in long-term care, mm -hmm. and that is simply um, not true. So today on the show, we will start our first part one of a three-part series of where to find a CNA's heart. And we reached out on a few of our CNA pages and asked members to stay where they are currently working at. You may hear some of our superstars' names mentioned more once we get started. Yeah. So today we're going to start with the letter A through E. And under the letter A, we have Activity Director Katie Page from Iowa, Alzheimer's and Dementia Unit, we have Pamela Brown from Iowa, our very own Sheena Bumpus from Oklahoma, Barbara Harris from Maryland, and I remember her from Washington, D.C., and oh, she, she is was. she's a blast. She's a firecracker. We also have Assistant Living, Kathy Johnson from Rhode Island, and Chrissy Morris from the state of Missouri. And under the letter B, we have the board of directors for NACA. We have Lisa Shepard, chair from Illinois, mm -hmm. Sherry Perry, chair from Tennessee, and Corinne Ganchin is chair from Missouri. That's me. <laughs> Samantha Maddox, secretary from Oklahoma. Sheena Bumpus, member at large from Oklahoma. Celeste Woon, member at large from Virginia. Mm -hmm. Tammy Jones, McClendon, member at large from Oregon. And Geraldine Mackey, member at large from Iowa. And then we have uh, one more board member. Oh, Brandon Fieldbrook, member at large from Michigan. Yeah. The letter C, we will salute all of our CNA superstars, our CNAs, our CMAs, and our CMTs. Also on the C, we will have Amanda Becker working with COVID patients from Iowa, Shannon Dunn, COVID unit in Long Turk from Oklahoma, the next letter is D. We have our very own Raymond Beavers, a dialysis technician from Iowa. And letter E, we have Korean EKG Tech. <laughs> oh. That's all the letters we will be doing for the first series of Work to Find a CNA's Heart. Please make sure you are wearing your mask at work and as well as play. There has also been members of NACA as well as the board of directors that have received their vaccination and are doing very well. Um, and they are also ready for their second dose. So if you have any questions or concerns about taking the vaccination, please reach out to us here at NACA. Please come back next week for part two of our CNA Heart. Don't forget to subscribe to CNA TV. See you next time on Everyday CNA. Bye for now.